Hi everyone, this is Aditya Sridhar from the top percentile. I am an alumnus of JBMS and welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to be discussing the cutoffs of the JBIMS MSc Finance batch of 2024. So basically last year's batch to help you decide whether you should apply for JBIMS MSc Finance 2023 to 2025 batch. As you might already know, the notice for the admissions are out already and the last date is 3rd August. So in this video, we'll be talking about the cutoffs and also I'll be sharing my opinion whether you should apply for this course based on your score. So let's get into it. So there's going to be an in-person assessment comprising of GD, PI and VAT, which is the written ability test. And that will be the second stage of assessment. For calling you for the in-person assessment, the factors are going to be your CAD, CET or your PSE score, um, your 10, 12th bachelor's degree marks, your extracurriculars and your work experience and your diversity. So all these factors are going to comprise of your application rating score, which will be used for calling students for the in-person assessment. Now, JBMS does not release exact cutoffs of the MSc finance batch. But last year we had TTV students who had made it into the JBMS MSc finance course. And that's what we did a little internal survey and informal survey to get an idea of what the cutoffs are. So please take this data points with a pinch of salt because these are not exact. And these are just based on us surveying and asking current students of the JBMS batch. So for open category last year, um, for males, the cutoff was 99 percentile around that. And for females, it was 98.5 percentile. So if you have a 98 plus percentile, a convert is possible with a strong GDPI and written ability test. For uh, the OBC category, the cutoff was around 97.8 percentile. And for students with a 96 plus percentile, you all should consider applying because a convert is possible with a strong profile and, and a good performance in the GDP and, and the written ability test. For uh, SC category and for other categories, the cutoff last year was around 96.7 percentile. The students with a 95 plus percentile, if you have a strong profile and you prepare really well for the GDP and uh, written ability test, a convert is possible. So hope this video helps. Once the calls are out for MSc Finance, we'll be launching our applying to JBMS MSc Finance. In case you guys have any questions, please feel free to contact our team in the on WhatsApp. Uh, the number mentioned in the description below, or you can leave a comment on this video and I'll try my best to answer that. Thanks for watching.